Hi, I'm Mick Garris, and today's trailer from Hell comes from 1969 and one of my favorite people, Ray Harryhausen. So this, I was a senior in high school when I saw this film at the El Cajon Theater, and it was one of my favorites of that year, The Valley of Guanji. To my knowledge, the Valley of Guanji is the world's first dinosaur western. I mean, what can go wrong? You got Ray Harryhausen, stop motion dinosaurs, and cowboys. Um, this is actually a Native American word for lizard, Guanji is. Shot in Spain, and this is just the perfect kind of trailer. It's all action, action, action. Very unusual in that there's no narration, there's nobody explaining what's going on, there's nobody telling you about the thrilling days of yesteryear. It's very similar to King Kong and Mighty Joe Young, the, the fantastic prehistoric giant beast. It's put on display here in a Wild West show, however, which is a little change of pace. And of course, the creature breaks free and all hell breaks loose. It was originally planned to be shot not long after the original King Kong. It was a Willis O'Brien project that he intended to do shortly thereafter, but they never got it off the ground. Originally it was called Valley of the Mists, and O'Brien even shot some cowboys in the jungle footage um, for that movie that ended up in, later in Mighty Joe Young in the 1940s. The star was James Franciscus, who was famous as a teacher in a series called Mr. Novak on television at that time. And Gila Golan, the female star, her accent was so thick that she was completely dubbed throughout the film. Much like Barbara Steele was dubbed in Pit and the Pendulum, even though I don't know why she was dubbed for that one. And of course, Richard Carlson um, was ubiquitous in films of this sort. This was much later than Creature from the Black Lagoon. It came from outer space. Uh, he died in 1977. I think this is some of Ray Harryhausen's best dinosaur work. Really good rear screen compositing without any lab work. Just one frame at a time. No CGI, none of that. And the trailer doesn't show it, but one of my favorite elements was the Eohippus, a miniature horse. So it was a great history and science lesson for me. I'd never heard of an Eohippus before I saw the Valley of Guanji. So here I was able to expand my knowledge because of that. So I don't know how many T-Rex uh, versus Stegosaurus or T-Rex versus elephant scenes that uh, Harryhausen has done, but I can never get enough of them. If you're anything like me, Valley of Guanji is a place to get your dinosaur fighting Jones fixed. Mm -hmm.